Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Blue and today I'm going to teach you about your cup that runneth over all the time and the reality that you are in control of your own cup. Um, it may at times seem like people around you are causing your life havoc, but in reality you are in control of your own cup at all times. So if you have not done so, please hit the subscribe button. I have great things in store for you. I hold manifestations for people. You can leave your manifestations answers in my comments. What we're going to discuss is an essential part of your manifestation journey, which is going to be your cup that runneth over all of the time. So back to what we were saying. Your cup, it runneth over every day, believe it or not. And I'm making this video because I'm seeing so frequently people are expressing all of these things that are going wrong in their life, but it's always tied back to something else. And this is why I always tell people that I mentor, let's leave the memes where they are, unless there's something to bring laughter or joy to you. Because just like a mantra has to be said 108 times a day because that's how we bring our manifestations through. All day long, we are saying negative things those negative things are going to end up manifesting in our life. So if all we post about is negativity, haters, a lack of support, not being able to find love, not being able to find success, those things, regardless of what you are posting them for, whether you're cross-posting, whatever, those things will manifest because there is so much supernatural power in your tongue. That is why we rely on the mantra. That is why we pray. And secondly, we rely on a mantra because we have the power in here to control our own destiny and our own life if that God has chosen for us to do with our life. We have the control here to do those things. So because of the power that lives within here and the power that after this video is going to end up living in your hand, you want to be very careful what you use your hands to type with. You want to be very careful what you use your mouth to speak. It literally could be going on around you, but if you ignore it and you don't allow that to transfer through your mouth, it, it, it will fade away, okay? Because you have that control here. So every morning you wake up with your cup full here, okay? And then by 9 a.m., right, you post, okay, well, I'm going to post my business anyway because people don't support me. There goes three-fourths of your cup, okay? So now you're here. There's your cup. It's, it's still got some liquid in there, but it, it's going down, okay? And that is not because someone actually did support your business. That is because you spoke that from your mouth, okay? And then we're going to take this as an example. I'm at a cookout. You know how it is at cookout. Sometimes there's pests there, there's flies there, whatever the situation is. You have your plate, you have your food, you're sitting down at the cookout. Now you have your drink. Your drink has no lid on it. Now, are you going to leave your drink exposed or are you going to protect your drink? Are you going to leave your drink exposed at the cookout or are you going to protect your drink? That's your response. Or are you going to turn around and blame your third cousin for not protecting your drink? With my cup is still sitting on the table, so now there's settlement. There's settlement going inside of my cup. There's all type of settlement going inside of my cup because I relied on someone at the cookout to watch my cup, okay, instead of myself personally watching my cup. Now I get back and, oh my goodness, there is settlement in my cup. So now I'm upset because this person was not as trustworthy as myself with my own things, with my own cup, with my own outcome. So I'm angry now, so I'm going to pour out more, okay? So by the end of the day, my cup is empty, but it has negative sediment inside of my cup. You are in control of your own destiny. You wake up with a full cup, you walk around, you protect your cup from sediment, you, you protect your cup from pouring out places where it's not pouring back into. You are responsible, you have to take accountability for the own depth of your cup everything will you know be better for you i want to just give this and leave this with you people around you people who have been around you since before time since before you became aware of your ability to manifest or people who came around before your success broke through or people who were there prior to your wilderness those people 
it's not that they don't see the greatness in you. It's not that they don't recognize it. It's not that they can't tell. Not that they don't appreciate it. It's the fact that people who feel inferior will only accept you at the level that they can control you. And I'm going to only leave it at that. People are only going to accept you at the level that they can control you when their initial intent was to control you. My name is Blue. Make sure you download your Bible app. I'll see y'all again very soon.